Coming up on today's episode of Chloe Has Me. Good morning, gorgeous. Good morning, gorgeous. Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Chloe Yasmin. If you're new here, but girl, if you're not, welcome back. I'm sure y'all can tell your girl is not covering up her acne for today's video because I'm feeling extremely confident. My skin is getting smoother every single day and I'm just so grateful for the process. And I'm also trying to show y'all the real real. I'm not the only one out here struggling with acne. But what these demons try to do is try to convince us that we're the only ones dealing with certain insecurities and certain things in our lives so we hide it because we feel like we're not normal. We feel like we're the weird ones. We're the odd ones out. Girl, no, I'm not the only one. Plus, I'm gorgeous. Good morning, gorgeous. Mm, good morning. Okay, girl. So yes, good morning, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I already said that. Oh my gosh, girl, stop doing that. As you all can tell by the title and the thumbnail, I am going to be hitting y'all with a self-care vlog. Okay, I'm not gonna lie though, today's self-care vlog is gonna be very different than my normal self-care vlogs. Girl, you ain't never even made a self-care vlog. What are you talking about? It's gonna be very different than my normal self-care videos. Usually on my self-care days, I'm just lazy, which isn't bad. You should definitely have your lazy self-care days where you get your home cleaned and stocked up the day before and then the next day you're able to just chill, take a bath or a shower, do your little body care, get up in your clean bed and watch some TV. But girl, I didn't really prep my home yesterday, so today's gonna be a self-discipline and self-love day. Because it is. I never really looked at self-discipline as a form of self-love and self-care, but it is. Because it's like when we do the things that we know we're supposed to do, when we don't wanna do it, that is taking care of ourselves and loving ourselves because those things are going to lead to a clutter-free mind, which means peace, girl. Okay, I did get a head start though last night, which probably wasn't the best idea because I'm tired. Cause I stayed up all last night, like deep cleaning my bathroom, scrubbing the heck, scrubbing the heck and down. I scrubbed down my bathroom so well, you guys. Like I was scrubbing the toilet down, the floors, the floorboards, the walls, girl, we, we, we was chilling. I bleached all my towels and rugs. So I gotta go ahead and put those up. So at least I ain't gotta do that, okay. But what I do have to do is wash all my bedding because I love when I get out of the shower, I smell good. My bedding smells good. Mm. It's a vibe. So yeah, the self-discipline things are going to be cleaning, going to Target and getting some groceries, but I'm not gonna be going grocery shopping. I'm just getting ingredients for a one pot stew. I ain't getting a bunch of stuff today. I'm just gonna get just the ingredients that I need for the stew I wanna make. It's a really gloomy, ugly, windy, cold day, which I feel like is a perfect opportunity to go ahead and make a nice, warm, comforting stew, comfort food. Yes, ma'am. And by the end of today, I'm going to feel amazing. And that is the whole point of self care so with that being said i don't want to like bother you guys did i show you guys my nails i just found these nails in my drawer my nail drawer these are so old they're so old the etsy shop that i got these on is shut down been shut down but i found these valentine's day nails and i'm like what a coincidence like i know valentine's day is over but like come on they're so cute like oh my gosh they're adorable so i had to go ahead and put these on this morning the self-care that i've already gotten done is time with the lord jesus christ of course that is extreme self-care for me. Girl, I can't do nothing without the Lord Jesus Christ. I'm at a point in my life where I have to literally ask the Lord Jesus Christ to help me with everything. Lord, I cannot go in this grocery store without you. I can't cook this meal without you, Lord. I can't film this video without you, Jesus. I need you. And the more we tell Jesus, I cannot do this. I have to rely on you. I have to depend on you. The more he comes and helps us the more he's able to move and work in our lives. But as long as we are trying to do everything by ourselves, he will allow us to do everything by ourselves. But we will be very frustrated and stressed the heck out unless we allow him to help us and we enter into the rest of the Lord Jesus Christ. And I'm sure some of you guys are like, well, how do I do that? Let me tell y'all something. Reading the word of God, 
reading the Bible really helps you to understand God's character and really helps you to understand who he truly is. Not what all these people say he is, not what they are saying, but who he truly is, is in the word of God. Amen. So once you get to learn and read about him, you get to learn he truly cares about you and he going to come through because he said he will and he can't lie. All right. But basically the word of God, reading and meditating on the word of God will really help you to understand God's character and help you to rely on him more. So yeah, I have done some Bible study. I ate some Panera bread. I had like a turkey avocado BLT. I did my nails and now it's time to start. Oh, my face getting red. And now it's time to start the cleaning.
Y'all like my shirt? I got this from Target in the Black History Month section. It says bold, black, and bougie. Yes, ma'am. All right, so my comforter and my sheets are in the dryer. I am getting ready to go ahead and head to Target. I have done my freshen up routine. So I don't always have time to shower and sometimes I don't feel like showering or I just wanna wait for my shower later on. So I have a signature freshen up routine. If you guys wanna know how I freshen up and smell amazing just like if i were to get out of the shower let us just know because it really comes in clutch especially if you're in a rush if you woke up too late or if you're just an extremely busy person like my mama's out there okay let us just know because my freshen up routine girl is heavily complimented okay it's heavily complimented i got my rings on i'm getting all my jewelry on i'm about to go ahead and switch out my bags so my mom bought me look how sweet she bought me them lilacs y'all see but she also bought me this new coach bag dang i can't talk <laughs> oh my god but like i was saying my mom just bought me this brand new coach bag when i tell y'all every time i look up there's something new she's getting me <laughs> so look at this i got this yesterday for valentine's day isn't this so cute so now all i need to do is clear out all this new packaging stuff and just put my wallet and stuff like that in this bag Look how cute this dang bag is, y'all. What the heck is happening? All I need is a beat the super bumping. Is my wallet, some hand cream, gum, lip gloss, and an eyelash spoolie. I haven't picked out my first fragrance of the day. I say first because I still have to shower and pick another fragrance. And I'm thinking I'm gonna go for fresh coconut cotton body spray. Okay, girl, gotta love it. We got that. I'm still waiting for my comforter and my sheets to get out, but I cannot wait, y'all. This looks a mess. And then I'm gonna layer on top of that Real Babe by Miss Guided. I bought a brand new one in my recent video because when I tell y'all this junk smells amazing, like, girl, this is the bomb. And y'all know I don't be scrimping on my fragrance. Uh-uh, y'all know your girl like to smell real strong. to each their own, but baby, that's my thing. Smelling good. He did? Oh, I feel so bad. I should have waved back. I didn't see his little butt. I just bought these dang sheets full price and they half off. What the? Oh, man. I guess I get another set. Cause I'm just trying to have like super bright lights in the bathroom so it looks super clear and professional. I can't believe I didn't come prepared. I hit you like that sometimes. I don't know. I didn't know why I didn't think of it either. What'd you say? <laughs> Okay, girl, so I made it home safely, amen. Okay, I got me a new little jumbo cooker so I can make the stew in this. I feel like this is gonna be perfect. So yes, ma'am, I got me a nice new cooker. Y'all see me buy some chicken breast. I got some parsley, some olive oil, some carrots and potatoes. I had to run to a little market called Fresh Time because I guess Target don't sell potatoes or carrots. Like, girl, what's going on? So anyways, yes, I got some carrots, some Little yellow potatoes, chicken. I got some garlic toast because I feel like it's gonna be really good with the stew, so we'll just have to see. And here, I have some bright light bulbs for my bathroom because it's gonna look a lot more professional and clean with a brighter light. Huh, I didn't clean that eye. 
Okay, I got some white washcloths because I need more white washcloths because they look so much better in my shower I also just ordered some all white Burt's Bees baby washcloths from my downstairs area because I want all white All white robes, all white towels, all white washcloths So I got an all white robe. Girl, I had to. These are so cute I went ahead and got this crushed ice tray Chicken broth. Yes, ma'am. You know you gotta have your chicken broth for your soups and stews And then last but not least my nephew was kind of bummed out that they didn't have the lemon lime prime drink but only the energy drink so i went ahead and got him this one because he's too young for energy drinks y'all i can't if you watched my last video you know so yeah that is everything that i got from target and now it is time to start pampering you guys i'm so excited peep the bright lights okay girl it is looking crispy clean and professional anyways before i go ahead and hop into my pampering and getting in the shower and get myself smelling good yes ma'am i have so many new products to go ahead and share with you guys i I really wanted today to be an enjoyable self-care day and I really enjoy things when I get new things I know it sounds bad but it's the truth okay so I went to Ulta yesterday and I had to go straight to the way products y'all cannot tell me their packaging is not the most aesthetic packaging for body hair I absolutely love their packaging and I am so obsessed so I went to Ulta yesterday and I bought basically like every single Melrose Place way product so with that being said let's look at everything that I got okay so first things first I have the way medium hair conditioner in the scent Melrose Place these are all in the scent Melrose Place it's kind of funny because one of my least favorite scents in the world is rose but this Melrose Place fragrance that way has made I'm pretty sure it's way I don't really know it smells so good and it is not the typical rose. It's a very classy, feminine, floral but woody kind of fragrance. So I kind of am obsessed. What? I kind of am obsessed. I kind of am obsessed. That it makes sense neither. But hey. So we got the medium hair conditioner and the medium hair shampoo. In my shower currently I have the thick hair shampoo and the thick hair conditioner and I really like those. I don't have thick hair but they work very well for my hair. They have thin hair, medium hair, and thick hair. I'm gonna try them all. I don't care. I'm gonna try them all. I also got a Melrose Place body cleanser. I've already been through a bottle of this and honestly at first I didn't like it until like the end of the bottle I started to become obsessed with the fragrance. So here we go. Number two. That's my second bottle y'all. They be charging an arm and a leg for these products. I'm not gonna lie but girl I could not pass down this body cream. They have a Melrose Place body cream and it's light pink. Isn't that so cute? I got the scalp and body scrub. Yes ma'am. This stuff smells so good y'all. And then let Last but not least, I got the perfume. Girl, this junk was expensive. But y'all know I had to go ahead and get it. So, yes ma'am. I got the shampoo, conditioner, body wash, body scrub, body cream, perfume. What the heck else could you possibly get? Anyways, girl, with that being said, now we can hop into the aesthetic body hair routine. I am going to be starting off my pamper night with chlorophyll. Chlorophyll is the natural compound in green plants that give them their color. But for me, of course, I use chlorophyll because chlorophyll has been proven to decrease body odors caused by bacteria. I'll go ahead and include these chlorophyll drops up on my Amazon storefront, link down below. Before I officially hop in the shower, I'm gonna go ahead and take my little fake earrings out and clip up my hair because unfortunately today is not wash day, so I will not be washing my hair hair i go ahead and get my oil diffuser started and going okay girl my favorite are the eucalyptus drops Ooh, mm -mm -mm -mm. these had to go ahead and get thrown away because they smell like water yeah water never buy no 3.99 essential oil drops in a three pack okay but like i said i go ahead and i put my little eucalyptus a eucalyptus drops up in there y'all and when i tell y'all you just smell it when you're in the shower mm -mm 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 -mm. i go ahead and i replace my razors because i do not like dull razors i love me a nice clean close shave girl i can't tell you how many times i didn't change my razor and i got cut or got razor burn oh girl ain't no joke okay but let's go ahead and hop up in this shower y'all peep my white robe yes i feel rich today okay look how beautiful my shower looks i'm so grateful mm. let's hop into this pampering okay so first things first i'm gonna go ahead and rinse my body off and just get my body adjusted to that nice hot water oh it feels so good 
Then I'm gonna go ahead and start cleansing my body with my white washcloth, okay? And my knockoff Dove soap. I got me some Walmart version of the uh, Dove Beauty Bar. It works just as good and it smells just as good. So I'm gonna go ahead and scrub it up my body. But this is a little bit weird, y'all. I do not cleanse my armpits on the same exact side of the washcloth that I cleanse my body. I be feeling like the deodorant is gonna get all over my body and it's gonna break me out. Ooh, acne prone skin problems. So of course I just go ahead and cleanse my armpits separate than my body, but everything gonna get clean. Everything gonna get clean. Everything gonna smell good. All right. <laughs> girl the other day i scratched the crap out of the back of my leg so i am trying to avoid this dang cut at all costs because baby it hurts but now let's go ahead and hop into my second cleanse so of course i'm going to go ahead and use the way melrose place body wash which i am so excited to go ahead and use today because this stuff smells amazing and it lathers beautifully but of course of course i'm using a loofah after all these years of saying i was never going to use loofah i hate loofahs they're not good they don't help you here I am live coming at y'all with a loofah in my hand on my body yes ma'am but I'm not gonna lie it did prove my point I have used or I used to use loofahs every single day and I still struggled with body odor but all of that came to a complete stop once I began to use washcloths washcloths allow you to get into places that you just cannot get into with loofahs loofahs are more fun to use but they're not gonna help you as far as body odor so this is what I'm gonna say. If you are going to use a loofah, please use a washcloth beforehand or even afterwards. Loofahs are not going to help with underarm odor or behind odor. It's the washcloths that really completely eliminate odor. And that is because they actually thoroughly clean you. But let's go ahead and hop into my exfoliation. So of course, I'm gonna go ahead and use the Way Scalp and Body Scrub. And when I tell y'all, there will never be a point in my life where I do not own a tub of this. This stuff is liquid gold. What the heck is happening? How can a body scrub be so creamy yet abrasive at the same exact time? How can a body scrub be so moisturizing and so strongly scented? And how the heck can a body scrub eliminate dry patches on your arm? I have been struggling with these dry patches on my arm from Accutane and this has improved it by a million percent. It feels like a freaking dream. But what I will say one of the perks of having a loofah is that it does exfoliate you honestly i didn't really need to exfoliate too much after using the loofah because it exfoliated me you will see that my skin does get a little bit red when scrubbing or doing anything to it even moisturizing because i'm so white y'all i took that from my daddy for real like this ain't no joke man i couldn't have got none of the color from my mama come on exfoliation always preps my skin for shaving to go ahead and give me a nice smooth and close shave look at my baby she always nosy she's so clingy but i am using the tree hut coconut lime shave oil i don't like it i don't like the smell but girl i had to go ahead and finish out this bottle i've been pouring this junk out like water just to get rid of it honestly i'm not even gonna lie at this point okay and then as far as my armpits i always use my gillette venus pubic hair and skin shave cream whatever the heck as well as the matching razor because these are the only products that do not make my armpits feel like they're being ripped in half i have very sensitive armpits now for feminine hygiene i'm gonna go ahead and use some baby soap cleanse up with a little baby washcloth and we're good all right you guys so it is now time to start moisturizing and applying all my smell goods baby i had such a nice relaxing shower i will say it is a little bit difficult as y'all can tell i'm talking totally different because i'm super chill and calm that shower be doing some things a nice hot shower girl anyway the only thing I will say that took a lot out of me <laughs> is showing my acne in my shower videos or like my shower scenes. I feel like my acne looks so much worse when I am doing shower scenes. Um, but I also sometimes feel like it doesn't look clean, which is not true at all. Acne is not dirty. Acne is not gross. It is very normal. And yes, we are beautiful with acne or without acne. I don't want to say acne is beautiful because I 
I think we all know nobody would choose acne. Wow, this body cream smells so good and it is so moisturizing and creamy. So I will have to say that that is pretty difficult for me at times, you know, showing my acne, but especially in those shower scenes. Man, there's like no way you can use whey products and not smell divine. I cannot believe this, girl. I'm gonna always buy me some whey products, honey, because I'm smelling like a bowl of flowers. Girl, oh my gosh, it's so moisturizing and a little bit goes a long way. I love that it's not too thick. Girl, I smell so good. What's going on? I'm gonna go ahead and open up the fragrance. I'm sure y'all can tell I haven't finished out my drink yet. That's me. I feel like I never finished my drinks, but I will finish it. Chlorophyll be coming in clutch, y'all, especially with hygiene. I couldn't get all the plastic off, but oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Yes, we love it. The packaging is so cute. I'm going to do the rest of my moisturizing off of camera, but I just want to go ahead and spray my legs real fast just to smell real nice and strong. Yes, ma'am, layering this fragrance is going crazy, girl. If you are wondering why I don't do any more live talking in today's video, I became very hangry and started not to feel too well, so I just made the decision to stop talking and just show what I'm doing and eventually do a voiceover. So girl, here I am. Right now, I am just doing some hair care, showing my hair some love. In tonight's video, I am going to be using my mom's hair juice. I call it hair food. She calls it hair juice she just made this for me a couple days ago and girl i am obsessed my hair smells like lemons my hair is super shiny and moisturized when i get done using this and girl i need it for that damage i have done to my hair thank you mom we love it okay i have been wearing twist a lot in my hair when i don't feel like doing any other hairstyle because it is a protective style for me and it really does keep my hair moisturized so i'm kind of in love with this hairstyle it's not the cutest but girl it works and it's simple and it's easy because i don't know how to braid like that <laughs> So here I am just retwisting my hair, locking in all that moisture, and here is my hair for the night. Isn't it kind of cute? I feel like it's kind of cute. I mean, it's not the cutest, but girl, it's kind of cute. I'm going to go ahead and spray the rest of my beautiful perfume. Yes, ma'am. And then we're going to go ahead and start cooking this beautiful meal. I love you guys, and this is the end of my voice.